In 2021, I voted the U-Scooter GTSE, the number one scooter, bar none, for the urban commuter. Just those short hops around town, getting from your place, maybe four or five miles down the road. It was amazing. It had shocks, it had power, plus it was so easy to fold up. This year, U-Scooter came out with the, I guess it's round two, version two. This is the GT Sport. I'm going to take it for a ride right around Victoria. I'm going to share with you what I like, what I don't like, and whether or not I think it's for you. So one of the things I really love about the GT Sport is that it's got a really powerful 700 watt motor at the front. It's got a battery in the middle here, 48 volts, 10.5 amp hours, which actually gives a pretty decent range, especially for a big guy like myself. I'm always amazed when I can find a scooter that's really lightweight and can still get this body around town. How fast does it go? We're gonna find out next. Almost gotcha. <laughs> So next up is the speed test as promised. I'm gonna be dodging peacocks here, but I'm gonna go straight past the cameraman, Michael. Michael, thank you for filming. And um, yeah, let's find out how fast this puppy goes. Alrighty, a bit of a running start here, up to the camera. Michael, the cameraman, 15. Displays, uh, says 20. Twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-five. Right. 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 <laughs> One of the most important things with an electric scooter is that it brakes really well. Uh, and this actually, I'm finding it is perfectly fine for my style of riding. Now I have noticed a little bit of a difference. Uh, there is a setup difference between the GT SE and the GT Sport. And that is that the actual regen braking isn't very strong um, when you're going faster speeds, but I'm finding it perfectly fine. So in fact, to that end, I'm gonna get up to max speed, which is about 25 miles an hour and scoot right and stop right in front of you. So I'm going about 23 miles an hour. I'm gonna lock it up as I right about now. And really, two car lengths, no problem whatsoever. I wanna cover off two things right now. Uh, one of the things you're gonna notice right away though is that we are in fact now in blue skies and uh, beautiful sunshine right here in beautiful Victoria. Uh, I wanna cover off the two things I'm gonna cover off now are how is it fold? Is it easy to fold? And then number two, ride quality. Let's cover the folding part first. There's a nice little step. You just step on it in the middle, folds down. I'm finding this actually a little bit easier than the GTSE. It looks, it looks really similar, but mechanically it's easier to fold, which is nice. It um, drops right into the uh, locking mechanism at the back and you're off to the races. And if you want to uh, actually save up a little bit of space as well, there's also the uh, handlebars will actually fold as well. So from the footage that you're watching right now, you can see that the scooter does a really, really good job with the suspension. I'm not actually accustomed for such a small scooter to having such a good suspension. It's quite smooth and I'm really quite happy with it. So, you know, if you're looking for a small, small little scooter that bounces around and gets over all those sidewalk cracks and bumps and stuff like that, even though it's got solid tires, the, uh, the suspension, it's really doing really, really well. And I'm 265 pounds and six feet tall and it's uh, eating up the bumps. So you're looking for a scooter that's really good for commuting. You're looking to get around town easily, something nice and small that you can actually stick in the trunk of the car, bring it on a subway, throw it in a bus. Maybe you're arriving to work or in class, you wanna put it under a desk. You want it to get enough charge that you can get home afterwards. Decent brakes, peppy. I don't think you can do any better than this. I mean, I've reviewed over 50 scooters now, and this is definitely the best scooter I've ever used for commuting. It's, it's, it eats up the bumps. I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna highly recommend it. Big guy approved.